Hello everyone, I am Siddharthan. In this video, I would like to give you the updated curriculum for our deep learning course. And from this week, I will be posting videos regularly following this particular deep learning course curriculum. So in this video, I will tell you what are all the modules that has been included in the deep learning course and what are all the topics that we will be covering in each of these modules. So these are the 13 modules that we will be having in this deep learning course. So first module will be on neural network basics. So we will start this deep learning course by trying to understand the basics of deep learning. What is meant by perceptron? What is an artificial neural network and all those things. Once we are clear with the basics, we will move on to the mathematics for deep learning part where we will discuss topics on linear algebra, statistics, probability and calculus. So I will also give you a document which contains all the topics that we will be covering in these modules so that you can have that for reference. So once this mathematics part has been completed, the third module will be on processing image data set. So there we will be discussing about how to process image data set and also about image augmentation. And once that has been done, the module 4 will be completely on computer vision and convolutional neural networks. So in this module, we will learn about the convolutional layers, max pooling layers, all those things and different activation functions that we can use for CNN, batch normalization and all those topics. And we will also be learning about object detection, semantic segmentation and a lot more topics on computer vision. There will also be, uh, you know, topics covered in transfer learning for CNN where uh, in that I will be explaining you how to use pre-trained models for computer vision. So the fifth module will be on text pre-processing where we will discuss about tokenization, stemming, lemmatization and various data pre-processing techniques that we have for text data. And the next module will be on NLP uh, where we will be using recurrent neural networks to train our NLP models. So in that we will be discussing about uh, normal like RNNs. Uh, so we will be discussing about LSTM and also word embeddings, language models. And we will also be discussing about pre-trained models and transfer learning uh, concepts related to NLP. And the seventh module will be on generative adversarial networks and eighth module will be on auto encoders. Again, the module 9 we will be discussing in detail about transfer learning. So at this point, we would have already discussed about transfer learning in computer vision 4th module and, and NLP 6th module. But we will also take some other uh, important transfer learning or pre-trained models that we have and we will be discussing about it. And the other thing is most of the modules will contain both conceptual videos as well as hands-on videos so that we can work on some use cases. And the 10th model uh, module will be on regularization, regularization techniques where we will be discussing about uh, the issue of overfitting and underfitting, how to perform dropout, L1 and L2 regularization and all those things. And the module 11 again will be on pre-trained models where we will take like uh, important pre-trained models like VGGNet, ResNet, uh, BERT, GPT, etc. And the 12th module will be on deep learning use cases. And the thing that I want to mention about this deep learning use cases is that uh, once in a while I will be posting use cases of deep learning, not just like after completing 11 modules, but also like while we are working on these modules so that we have a conceptual learning as well as like a practical knowledge of how to use deep learning for uh, uh, use cases. So this module I'll be posting videos regularly while we are covering like these modules as well, just the way we did for our machine learning course. So the module 13 will be on neural networks deployment. So how you can train a neural network and how you can deploy that, uh, you know, for a web app or for production. So all those things we will be discussing in the module 13. So these are like the overview I wanted to give you about. And now I'll tell you what are all the topics that we will be covering in each of these modules. So I'll give you a PDF file. So I'll give the link for this PDF file in the video description so you can download this file and keep it for your reference. So this is like the entire curriculum. So this is like a tentative curriculum. So I may or may not add few uh, topics. I may remove few topics based on the requirement of the course. But this is like the overall idea. So first we have this neural network basics as I've told you and these are the topics that we will be covering such as like introduction to deep learning is what we will start with and we will also discuss about perceptron and how to build a perceptron in Python and how to train an artificial neural network in Python. So this module uh, contains both conceptual as well as the uh, hands-on part as I told you before. So to say all these modules will contain like both hands-on videos as well. And next is like mathematics for deep learning where we will be discussing about linear algebra, statistics, probability and calculus. And these are the topics that we will be covering for image data processing and augmentation and for computer vision. And the other thing is like each of this topic will have multiple videos. Say for example, if we take this linear algebra, 
there can be like six or seven videos in this topic and similarly for image pre-processing we may have multiple videos so there is a chance that most of these topics will have multiple videos so this is a pretty long course and the main idea that i add while preparing this curriculum is that we want to learn as deep as possible so that's the main idea of this so in this module 4 which is basically about com computer vision and cnns we will be discussing about this cnns transfer learning object detection image classification semantic segmentation and so on and next will be on uh, ticks pre-processing and nlp as i have told you and the module 7 is, is about this gans and we will also be discussing about auto encoders in our module 8 and again module 9 is about transfer learning so we would have already dis discussed some topics on our module 4 which is computer vision and module 6 which is nlp so we will be discussing some more uh, topics of transfer learning such as like how you can fine tune the pre-trained models how you can extract features uh, using pre-trained models and you can like how you can use it for your custom data set and so on and next we'll be discussing about regularization techniques not only these things also like some more important concepts as well and then we will be discussing about some of the pre-trained models how to use that and all those things and then we have this deep learning use cases and finally we have new neural network deployment right so these are the entire thing that we will be covering in this deep learning course and uh, these are the various domains in which we will be doing some use cases so we will be working on image classification object detection semantic segmentation image generation so all these things and also text generation sentiment analysis time series prediction so i have tried to include like various domains and, and various like categories so that we have like a wide range of knowledge as well as a deep knowledge so we will be also building recommendation system anomaly detection speech recognition so these things will be covering in nlp aspect so all these are uh, in all these topics we'll be probably doing multiple use cases so that's the idea for this uh, module tool which is like deep learning use cases so i just want to give a detailed view of what we'll be discussing here in this module tool and also we'll be having this uh, generative models for text generative models for images transfer learning and how to you know build end-to-end -end deep learning pipelines and uh, again these are some of the uh, you know uh, key things that we have like how to debug the model how to visualize the performance and other things and how you can like deploy the deep learning models um, on like cloud platforms like maybe azure or aws we will also be exploring various uh, you know methods for it for personal use or if you're like working in a company like what would be the best approach in that case so those things and distributor deep learning is something that we'll be covering in a basic level uh, i'm not sure like how deep we can cover that so that is like the other thing and how to interpret your model prediction so we have built our model and we have like built a system but we will also try to understand like how the model is making prediction so that we are getting some inference out of it so these are the overview of the topics that we will be discussing and as i've told you i'll give the link for this uh, pdf uh, this deep learning curriculum in this video description so you can download this and keep it for future references i hope everyone is excited to learn a deep learning course as well and i'll see you in the next upload thanks for watching